happy November 1st, everyone. Welcome back to my channel. This is Charlotte. Hard to believe October is gone over. Yeah, I just would love a do-over. Anyway, we are playing with index cards today. And um, this is our make. It's a cutie. Look at that. We have a little pocket back here, a ticket, a piece of fall ephemera. This flips up. You can journal on that. Turn it over. Look how cute. And here's a pocket. And I added another pumpkin. Just adorable. So this is what we're making. And oh, you want you want to know where the yeah right here look at this we're using a little bit of velcro there we go the velcro is um i didn't get the glue all the way but it's okay the velcro is optional you could put um you could just leave it you could use a um paper clip uh, you could do various things to this. You could put tabs on here to flip up. But I've got a lot of Velcro, and I thought, why not? Um, if you don't have Velcro, you want Velcro, I'm pretty sure I've got some Velcro under my in my description box. So the Velcro dots. So go have a look. But this is what we're making. So you need a three and three quarters by 12 inch piece of cardstock. You could do four. Four just seemed a little bit large for me. So, um, you know, I had to make it difficult. We did three and three quarters, but four would be fine. Then you're going to score it at four and you're going to score it at eight. And you're going to fold it depending upon what you want to be your front. I used Halloween paper for this. And um, you want it to flip up this way. This is going to be hidden with your index card. So we're going to go this way. This is going to be hidden with another piece of cardstock. So this is what you're going to look like when you fold it. It's going to go this way. So once you have that, let's ink. And yes, I got a new dauber. I go through the daubers like crazy, don't I? I want to put a thumbnail because this is going to be your pocket. So I want a thumbnail here. You may in the background hear the garage door going up and down. I apologize for that. Our door is, it's given us trouble and I think it might have to be replaced. So my husband's out there playing with it. So if you can hear that, that's what that is. And the little pumpkin, those I know I got at Hobby Lobby last year on sale. And so I plan on going to Hobby Lobby today and um, seeing what I can find. And I'll do a haul for you if I find anything good. I don't know why I punched that because we still need to put our piece of cardstock on so I kind of jumped the gun and we're gonna go this way I guess we could go this way hmm I think I did it the other way on this one yeah up and down so I think and we're putting this on the back so let me just see one of my sweet subscribers gave me these last year. Yeah, let's go up and down. So um, I want to thank you, thank you, because those fussy cuts are just adorable, and I love them. And um, I want to wish all November, all November birthdays a happy, happy birthday. And also, don't forget, send some love um, to Roseanne. Hopefully her hubby has had his surgery and he's fine. I haven't been in the comments. I'm behind. So I apologize for that. I will get there. So we're just going to put this on. And this is optional. You don't, you don't have to put this on. I don't, obviously don't want to see Halloween paper. So that is why this is going on. 
and then we need to punch this because I was a little premature. Okay, so we've got that. Let's do our, that little bit that shows is no big deal. We're not worried about that at all. That's okay. What do you think about my, isn't that so cute? I call it my retro glue dangle. I am in love with that. I had to get it on before uh, I'm going to have to switch out the beginning of the year. Let's make our pocket. So we're just going to glue this up. So we're going to put our glue. And for those of you that have wondered about if you saw the uh, my retro Mickey ear glue dangle, I apologize. I haven't gotten it in my shop yet. This one. I need to get my photos. Isn't it so cute? I mean, really? What's not to love? That is so cute. If it doesn't sell, I'll be more than happy to keep it. Oh, my gosh. Too cute. Okay, so we've got that pocket made right here. And we're going to put... I mean, how cute are these guys? Open them up and journal in them. And um, I've got, if you're following the Monday challenge, uh, somebody had wanted, somebody had asked me in, in the comments if I was going to sell those. The uh, pockets with the, uh, the bag pockets with all the ephemera. They are in my shop right now. If you're seeing this, if they're not there, it's because they've sold. Otherwise, they're there. And they are 20% off. Everything in my shop right now is 20% off. So if there's anything you had been eyeing, now is the time to go because the sale's going to end. I believe I have it going through the, to the either the 6th or the 9th of um, November. Okay, so cute. Um, if the person that sent me these is watching, can you just put something in the comments and maybe say where you got these? Because these digitals, these little fussy cut digitals were super, super cute. And this is what I chose to go on the back because this then can go on a journal either way. Super, super, really, really cute. Whoever did these digitals, the maker, very, very cute. So we're going to get this down. This down, just like that. So pretty. Look at that. Isn't that cute? Okay, that leaves us the front, and that leaves us our index card. And I did not do any of the uh, inking on the index card. So what you're going to do is just open this up. And I wanted to say uh, the two winners of the bags um, with the tag and the fold-out, I still have those because I ran out of these. My husband got these at Walmart for me yesterday. So I will be getting your win in the mail next week. I really apologize about that. But um, I can't send out something I don't have and I did run out. So we are going to just measure this to see where we need to be. cut that off right there so let's get the cutter yes I apologize I think it's been probably two weeks possibly three this might be the third week that you've been waiting and I apologize about that but it is a it is a Christmas so um, we should be good and this should fit Yep, so let's go ahead and just ink this just a little bit. So 
because we're not going to go end to end, top to bottom. We're going to have just a little bit of the Graphic 45 showing. So I think what I'm going to do is, I didn't do this with the last one. Fold it first. Let's see if this helps. Let's just see. I want to get that on there good. Probably should have gotten my glue stick out and I didn't. And that's probably why. And I didn't wait for it to dry, so I'm sure that doesn't help either. So what I'm going to do is do this. Get this on. Let's do it this way. Getting glue everywhere. Looks like I'm showing just a little bit there. Let's see. Don't want it to glue itself together. Okay. So let's get a white. I think this is my last. I think I've got, no, don't I have one more? I thought I had one more white. I do. Down in the corner. There we go. Okay. Let's just. We should be good. Okay. So now. We want, I'm going to give that just a couple minutes to dry and let's do the front and then we'll come back with our little Velcro dots. So simple, you don't have to glue them or anything. Just stick those babies right on there. So you can see, simple little project with a lot of potential for writing. So fun. Okay, I don't think we are going to be using this or that. So which way do we want this to go? Okay, we're gonna now. You this can be a a um, pocket or no pocket. We're gonna make it a pocket, and to make it a pocket, we're just gonna go around the sides and the bottom, come up like that. And if you have words, so cute to put words on here. Do I have a ticket? Looks like I only have one ticket, but I have one of these, so let's put this in there. That one's got, oh, we didn't need that either. We've got this guy. That's right. I was going to say, what do we have in that other one? We had a little die cut, and a ticket. Super cute. So I think we might have the ticket on the die cut. Yeah, look at that. That's how it goes. I thought that was a little bit not right. Not right. So we're just going to put some glue on here, just like that, and then put our die cut on. I like to see the numbers uh, on the ticket. So I'm going to put this like that. And 
let's put our sweet little retro Christmas dangle in here. Maybe, come on, go in there. We're done with you. Okay, and then this just slips right in there. You have got the cutest little card. Look at that. And then this, we need our Velcro. This one doesn't seem to need Velcro. The other one was popping up. But we're going to do Velcro. And then you've got your back with your, with your um, other little pumpkin right in here. So let's get out the Velcro and... I'm going to have to check and see if I've got these in my shop. So I put the um, rough part, and you probably could cut these in half so they're not quite this large. So I'm going to just stick that right on there. They're pretty sticky. And then grab one of these. And what I like to do is put this on, can't see, and close the top like that. Let's put these away. I need to start doing more where I use the Velcro because, um, boy, I've got some that are, that are just stuck to me because I've got so many. So there is our card, and isn't she just as sweet as can be? And of course, you can do a lot with this. So let's see if we gingerly open this up, and there you go, guys. So isn't that cute? Hopefully you love the make this week. Um, I hope everybody has a fantastic weekend. This might be the last day that we focus on fall. I think I'm going to move on to Christmas. Meanwhile, we've got three of these to give away. Oh, these are so cute. I, I'm just in love with this. Really, really love this. So, okay. Good luck, everyone. Let's see what we've got going here. How about Ann Kathy? And Kathy, one of these is coming to you, and I will have these in the mail this week. And I know I've got a couple new names in here that gave me their addresses. Karen Allen, this is coming your way. And, you know, if you don't win one of these, I hope that you'll make one because these are always very easy and they're just super cute. Vicki Jensen, all right, my three sweet friends. These will be on their way to you along with the other ones uh, this coming week, guys. So have a spectacular weekend. I will catch you Monday where I'm thinking we're finishing up the... Um, the bags and then the following week we will be on to a new challenge so everyone take care have a spectacular weekend and i'll see you in the next one bye guys hugs